Okay, we're gonna go over the workout we did today as a group. So today's, it was one of our Tuesday workouts. Tuesdays and Fridays, we do strength. So what I want you guys to focus on is that progressive overload. Lifting heavy, pushing yourself, pushing your muscles. Um, like, it's mental, it's a mental thing. A lot of people get, they get nervous and scared. So just do it, do the work. And I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do the form. So the workout we're doing today, and we did this morning as a team, it was power cleans. So I want you guys to stretch good. Power cleans are gonna be full body. So I want you guys to stretch your full body, stretch your legs, your hamstrings, your um, lats, lats, traps, everything. Cause you're gonna be pulling. Your traps are gonna be sore. So make sure you guys are stretching. It's really important to elongate those muscles and get them nice and long. So the movement, I'm gonna show you guys with a barbell and then I'm gonna show you guys with the dumbbells. Cause I do know a lot of you guys are starting to get barbells, which is awesome. Uh, I know Black Friday is coming up. If you guys can find some barbells on a good deal, share it with our group. We are trying to save you guys as much money as we can. Um, so the power clean. Uh, we've done this a lot together. I know this isn't our first time, so I will touch on it. I'll go over it. That way you guys aren't confused because there's a few things that I see happen all the time. Uh, so I do correct it if I, if you guys want to zoom with me. But when you guys are doing it via YouTube, I can't see what people are doing. Um, but so the power clean, what you're pretty much doing, you're getting it from the ground to your slow pull, slow pull, slow pull. As soon as you get to that knee, this is when we get that power position. So remember, this is power position. You're going to pull, open those hips, go onto those toes. This is when you're shrugging. We're shrugging and we're dropping, catching together. So it's not a full squat. It's not a full squat clean. It's a power clean. So from the bottom. Stand up. I want you guys to think about very fast elbows. You have to be quick and intentional with these elbows. Um, and I don't want any arms bending before your hips are open, you're fully extended at the hip, and you're on your toes. And that's when we're gonna drop, catch, fast elbow. So I'm gonna show you guys a few reps with a barbell, what it's supposed to look like, because I know um, a lot of you guys have done these a lot with me, so you guys know exactly what we're doing. So we're gonna start with that barbell on those shins. Barbell on those shins. Your feet are under your hips. Feet are under your hips. Your hands are just gonna be like the pulleys. They're just gonna go straight down. So they're gonna be like under your shoulders. You're not coming in, you're not coming out. Your hands are right under those shoulders. So, let me let my husband in. Okay. So what this is gonna look like you're keeping that barbell nice and close to your body. Shoulders are pulled back. Back spine is neutral. Spine is always neutral, you guys, and lifts. We're gonna pull fast elbows. If you're gonna notice something, I'm always gonna be quick with my elbows. And that's how you're gonna be, get the weight up, and you're gonna be able to keep the weight up. When we're slow, you're using pure strength. Use your momentum. Don't slowly, because as I get heavier, I'm not gonna be able to get that up and keep it up. So I'll show you guys one from the front. So keep the barbell close to our body, fast elbows, stand up, and then back down. Back to the ground. Fast elbows. Back down. So I know I'm making it kind of look easy. It's not super easy. You got practice makes perfect. Practice makes progress on all of these movements. So don't be hard on yourself. If you want, if you're in the app with me and I'm coaching you, send me a video of you doing these in the app. I promise I will give you some feedback and I will give you guys some something to work on if you have something we need to work on with these because they are easier for someone else to point out. Uh, something you could do is video yourself from, from the side. The best time to video yourself is from the side and that's where you're gonna see most of the imperfections or even from an angle, like from an angle like this. But the side, you're gonna see how close that barbell goes. So the reps we're doing today, you guys are doing 10, 10, eight, six, four, two, one. So guess what that means? I am challenging you guys to find a heavy power clean. If you guys have barbells and you guys have lots of equipment, load the weight as you keep, keep building. Challenge yourself, get a heavy one. Max out if you can, find your new max. Um, I know Lynn today got her, 
she got her OPR, which is amazing. Um, so this is what it's going to look like when I'm going for like the, I will show you guys like what the six looks like. This is what the six would look like. So, sorry, I don't even know if I did six. I wasn't counting. Um, I'm hook gripping. So always think about putting your thumb around the barbell, hook grip, wrap your thumb. Always get into that um, routine of hooking that thumb. I promise it's gonna help you lock that barbell in. But that's what the um, six would look like or whatever I just did. But the 10, and they don't all have to be touch and go. When I got down to four, I broke it up. I think I did two and one and one. Um, when I got to the two, I did two singles because it was heavy. I, I went pretty heavy. Um, and as it gets heavier, remember, it's okay to drop more. As it gets heavier, drop more, and I promise it's gonna help you get more weight up. Um, if you're using the dumbbells for this workout, that's okay as well. Dumbbells, which I know a lot of you guys have dumbbells. We're gonna have them at that mid-shin. Mid-shin, same thing, fast elbows. Fast elbows, stand up, feet back together. So when you drop, you don't have to keep your knees closed. Drop in that good position. So make sure something you guys can even do is practice without anything. Come up, drop. Practice the drops, coming back together. Drop, come back together. Practice that, practice quick feet, quick elbows. Quick, 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 you gotta be quick and snappy. If you're slow, you're gonna struggle with increasing your weight. Um, but I did this workout this morning. It was great. It was a great workout. Um, so I want you guys to give it a go. I want you guys to have a good night and I will see you guys later.